Now we have MongoDB database and Mongoose library. Mongoose is a popular object data modeling library for MongoDB. It allows us to interact with MongoDB easily with JavaScript commands. Let's have a quick look at mongoosejs.com. Here we see a simple example of using Mongoose. In this example, we want to save a cat to database. We need a model for cat, and this cat must have a schema, for example, a name with type of a string. Then we use that model to interact with database. Let's copy this cat model and go to our project and create our book model. Creating a model in index.js is not a good idea. It is better to always have a folder structure. Let's create a new folder named models. In this folder, we keep all our project models. First, I paste the cat model here. I change its name to book. Then, I use export keywords so that I can use it in another file. For a schema, this book just has a name, but what if we want to have other fields? The better approach is to create the schema outside and use it here. We have a schema method of mongoose that can help us. So let's create a book schema variable and it equals to mongoose.schema and inside of that we can have an object of fields and each object can have some options. First I want title with type of a string and I want it to be required so I use required true. Let's copy paste it and have an author again with type string and required of true. Again paste and have a publisher field. This field has type of number and this is it. We don't need ID because ID will be handled automatically by database and you will see this. We can have some other fields for timestamps like time of creation and time of last update. In order to having them after fields object, let's have another object and add timestamps true. And that's it. Now let's use this book schema for our model. The book model is now ready to use.